sitting in the hen house don't make you a chicken, and sitting in the church house don't make you a Christian. <laughs> My mother-in-law used to love to say that, Jean Hurtenberger. Every time someone would, she would hear somebody say, I know I need to get in church, or people ought to come to church, or if everybody would just go to this church or that church, and she'd always kind of chuckle and then say that. Sitting in the hen house don't make you a chicken. And of course, everybody would know that. <laughs> Just going and sitting among, and I, some of you don't even know what a hen house is. I do. I, I remember chicken coops and going in and gathering eggs. I never wanted to spend any time in there, but I sure knew sitting in there wouldn't make me a chicken. But you know, it's also true that just going to church doesn't make you a Christian. You know, sometimes even we Christians kind of miscommunicate as if the important things, get in our church, help our numbers, you know, give to our church, do our ministry all through our church programs. Let the church ministers tell you everything you need to know about the Bible. And sometimes we kind of miss the whole point. We've made church into a big organization. And I don't think that's what it is. I think the church is the group of people who have given their life to Jesus. If you want to be a Christian, it's giving your life to Jesus. It's doing what Jesus asks. It's living like Jesus. It's dying and being buried with Jesus in baptism. It's being raised to a new life with Jesus. And then if you do that together, you are church. We do church stuff, not as programs, but we meet together to encourage each other and do more love and more good things and share the good news with more people. You know, we've all known them, those people that come to church but don't really do church, aren't church. Maybe they're there for business reasons because it helps their image. Maybe it's a new pool of people to sell their products to or whatever. Some people come to church because it's a habit. Some come because their family expects them to, but at some point, God's going to weed out the, hey, I'm just here because people, from the people that are there because of Jesus. It can be a lot of reasons to go to church, but don't ever confuse yourself. Going to church doesn't make you a Christian. Following Jesus is where you become a Christian, and then we are church. So I've always appreciated my mother-in-law and always thought, boy, that's right. And I've repeated that to a lot of people that say things like, I need to get back into church. And I say, no, you need to get back connected to Jesus. And church will take care of itself because we are church. So follow Jesus, not the church house. This is Steve Ridgell thanking my mother-in-law for words of wisdom.